I love loads of the lashes for different reasons, but my go-to lash for a night out would have to be the little black dress. Always carry the glue with me in my makeup bag or in my handbag on a night out. Um, because it's just good just to top up if you're staying out all night, all hours, you have to always pack your glue. My favourite nail trend is using the Impress nails. I literally go on about them all the time. I've told all my friends to get on board. And my favourite at the moment is what I'm wearing today. Recently, I went to the Brit Awards and I saw Dootson, and she is my favourite supermodel at the moment. And she looked just as stunning in real life as she did as she does in pictures. I like all different makeup looks, but my favourite is probably focusing on the eyes. And so I learned years ago to start with the eyes first and then do your foundation. Because if you do your foundation first and then go crazy with the eyes, it can fall down, it can mess up all the makeup you've done around it. So start with the eyes and you can clear away all the mess you've made and then put your foundation on. On average, I'd say probably an hour if I'm like washing my hair and doing my makeup. But if I have two hours, I will take it. If I have three hours, I'll take it. And if I have half an hour and I've got no choice, then I'll take that as well. <laughs> you know those strips that you can put over your nose from Bois? Is that how you pronounce it? Bois. You know the ones I'm talking about? Yeah, you can get these strips that you put over your nose from Bois and they just like, they're called like blackhead strips or something. And sometimes we do a mask and then we put the strips on and then we watch the TV together. <laughs> I think the most important thing for beach makeup is to wear SPF, really. And sometimes you can get some really nice SPFs that have a glow in them. And I think that's all you need because you want to get the tan, so you don't want to be wearing a full face of makeup. I think my most used app would probably be Instagram. Really, to get the best picture for Instagram, it's all about the lighting. I hope I've got nice lighting on me right now. I sort of stalk everyone. Do you ever find that you're like scrolling through and it's like a, you click on one name, it leads you to another name, leads you to another name, and then you're on someone's profile you've never met, you've never heard of, but you're looking through their pictures and you're like, how did this even happen? Um, probably the girl who's like this. <laughs> The sort of exercise I like to do, I love being active, but I don't necessarily love running or being on the treadmill, so I enjoy more classes. I love dancing, so if there's an opportunity to go to a dance class or do something like that, I would much prefer it. My favourite way to pamper myself is to go to the spa. I love massages, I love facials, anything like that I just love. So I try and squeeze it in whenever I can. But usually after performing, I like to celebrate and cheers with my friends and family. <laughs> For the summer, it would definitely be the original version of Baby because it gets you up dancing, makes you feel happy. We're going to be performing it all over the summer in Ibiza festivals and I literally can't wait. I think right now I'm going to go for Calvin Harris because I love my favourite songs that are out at the moment are his. Summer has to be summer. I'm most looking forward to doing shows and festivals and like I said, going to Ibiza and just playing baby with Anton Powers everywhere and inviting all my friends and just having the best summer ever. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe for more videos like this.